coming to paperback and Kindle this fall. E-Steam Blast from the Past. Hell's aspiring angel takes on her demonic doppelganger in this time-traveling, action-packed E-Steam series adventure. Pre-order your copy of E-Steam Blast from the Past. I got some more fantastic fan art from Run.exe, the artist who did the digital art featuring Matilda Crowley a couple of years ago. And this time he's decided to do some fan art for some cards that he wants me to offer in a future Indiegogo or a Kickstarter of Isis and Esteem. And now I really love these two pieces, they're absolutely fantastic, and I wanted to share them with you before I went out here and presented them as part of a perk for an Indiegogo or a Kickstarter and share his art in that project, which is probably going to be either the Isis graphic novel or the John Haynes graphic novel. I'm currently developing right now. Now, the first piece of art that he has presented as related to these cards is a picture of Isis, and he clearly was inspired by two of the covers I did, had Bill Walko do in the past, Isis, Wrath of the Cyber Goddess, and Isis, the main event. That's where he said he got the idea for, from the Isis um, card, and I have to say he really captured the spirit of the Isis character, and he really did a great job of presenting her her traditional costume and making it look more goddessy. I really like what he did here with his design, and he made the goddess next door really look like a goddess in this card, and I really love the way he did everything from the SJS Direct logo he's made, to the Ankh in the background, to having Isis looking very powerful and regal in this picture. And I like the way he's put on some nice um, things as related to the details of her outfit. It really makes her look like a goddess. And he said he drew some inspiration from some things I talk about, like in my live streams, how I originally was inspired to create Isis from Halle Berry. And back in the day, because I wanted to, back in the day, Halle Berry was the inspiration for the first Isis. Later on, I went with Tia Maori because Tia Maori had the values of the goddess next door, but originally the look came from Halle Berry, but that's, that's, that's another thing, but that was where I got Isis from. He drew from that, from everything I've talked about in my live streams and my videos to create this fantastic digital art, and it, it just looks like, it just is absolutely great, and I really wanted to share this with everyone before I put it up as a perk on Indiegogo and Kickstarter for that upcoming Isis graphic novel or the John Haynes project I'm working on. So it's still in the air. Um, I have two scripts, so I really wanted to do do that. So we're, we're still, I'm still working on that right now. Now the second piece he presented was a E-Steam card. And this E-Steam card really is another great piece. Now this one, is taken from the story e Steam No Good Deed that I recently turned into a comic with Bill Walko and he's done a great picture here of e Steam looking in the mirror at this department store and we see the human on the outside and in the mirror we see the demon on the in, on, in the mirror being reflected and I love this image because this is something I would probably put on a cover for a e Steam comic um, from the Demon era, and it really captures who she really is during the Devilish Diva era. I mean, this really captures her, and I have to say, this double-breasted dress that he gave her, this is something I actually am featuring in the 2021 e Steam story, e Steam hashtag cancel vacation. This is this was an outfit that I actually have. Um, been working on for that story and he designed it and it's, it's 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 just great to see this design and he really made it pop far better than anything I could have imagined I mean I came up with this new double-breasted dress 
for Easteen to wear for that story. And he's given me inspiration to go out here and sketch it up in another model sheet um, for that story, hashtag cancel vacation, which is going to be one of the stories coming in 2021. And he says that he drew from everything I talked about, about Easteen being inspired by actress Sally Richardson Whitfield, because actress Sally Richardson Whitfield is the inspiration for Easteam. Her that's the voice I hear whenever I do the narration for Easteam in the stories. Just like usually when I write Isis, I usually hear Tia Maori's voice when I'm doing the narration for Isis. So he really uh, captured a lot of the things I talk about. And what's really fascinating for me is that he just does he gets that based on just the copy and the covers of the books and sometimes some of the things that I say in the videos and he really has a great eye for the characters and really does a great job in his digital art capturing the spirit of those characters and I really want to thank Run.exe for taking the time to make this fantastic digital art of Isis and Esteem and I'm definitely going to put this in again like he asked a trading card for a Kickstarter or an Indiegogo for the upcoming Isis graphic novel or the John Haynes graphic novel as a perk and I'm gonna try to make sure that I share that with everyone for that campaign because I, I love his art I mean he really has an eye for capturing the spirit of the characters that I designed like I love I still love that Matilda Crowley piece he did to this day. I mean, that that is one of the most beautiful black goth digital pieces I have ever seen. And many people in the scene actually love that piece. And it has inspired so many black kids out here to think about um, being a part of the goth scene and, and listening to the music and learning more about the goth scene. So I, I'm hoping that this will inspire black comic fans, black sci-fi fans, and black fantasy fans to also go out here and check out more black fantasy and the books of the isis and the esteem series and again i want to thank run.exe for going out of his way taking his time and making these fantastic pieces of digital art and sharing them with me and i'm really glad i'm really eager to share more of his art with you now if you have some fan art you want to go out here and um, share with me of my characters like Isis, Esteem, John Haynes, Matilda Crowley, or any of my other characters like Marilyn Marie or Cassandra Lee from the old early days of the SJS Direct Imprint, you can send me an email with a digital piece, whether it be JPEG or TIFF, and you can send that to sjsdirectamerica at gmail.com. And if I get your art, I will either feature it in the back of an upcoming Isis or Esteem series book, like the 2021 titles Isis Revenge of the Cyber Goddess, or Esteem hashtag cancel vacation, or John Haynes taking care of business. And your art will be shared all over the world with all of the readers out there who have enjoyed SJS Direct Imprint books all across the globe again if you want to send me a piece of fantastic fan art i will you can send that to my email at sjsdirectamerica at gmail.com i thank run exe again for these fantastic pieces and i thank you for watching this video now if you want to see me when we want to pick up the books of the isis series or the esteem series you can find those books on amazon.com in paperback and kindle format and if you want to see me make more videos and more books like this, you can donate to the Patreon, the PayPal, or the Cash App by clicking the links in the description box. That's all I have to say for this video. You can comment, rate, and subscribe. Now available in paperback and e-readers, Isis, Samurai Goddess. The Goddess Next Door takes on Kung Fu killers in this action-packed martial arts Isis series adventure. Get Isis, Samurai Goddess, in paperback and e-readers today.